And the question remains, would you hire them just because they are not fit? For me, I would say... Would you hire a personal trainer that is not fit? Should you? That is the biggest question here. When you look at the personal trainer, sometimes we want to get inspiration from them. But at times when you look at them, they are not fit. And the question remains, would you hire them just because they are not fit? For me, I would say it depends. It depends on their experience. Because some, some of them are like a veteran. They have been personal training forever. They have so much knowledge that it doesn't match with their body because of old age, the normal process of aging. Just because they're not super fit when you look at them and they're not inviting, that doesn't mean they're lacking the experience, okay? It's not every coaches out there that are fit. You see coaches that trains those NFL players, they're not fit. They're there with a big belly. But that doesn't mean they, should, they, they shouldn't hire them. It's because of their expertise. For me, I would hire a personal trainer that is not fit based on their expertise, based on how many years he has been in the field, based on, uh, uh, like I said, his expertise, he or she, her expertise, right? I would not just go for the aesthetic look. I would go for what they know because sometimes knowledge, knowledge is gold. And knowledge sometimes in personal training could be valuable or is valuable than the aesthetic. Even though our overall goal is health, but when it comes to hiring personal training, it's to get fit, isn't it? We want the aesthetic as well. The client wants the aesthetic that you bring to the table. A client will quickly hire a personal trainer that is aesthetically, you know, promising to deliver the job. Even though sometimes just because the personal trainer is super fit, it doesn't mean you're going to get as fit as him or her. As disappointing as that sound. But has a client who is going to spend his or her money on someone in order for that person to train them to get fit and healthy, will they or should they hire a personal trainer that is not physically fit? Biggest question. They should not hire a personal trainer that lacks the expertise and that is not physically fit. That's the other condition. If you lack the expertise, and you're not physically fit, let's say, you, let's say you've been a personal trainer for like for like a year or two or three, and physically you're not fit, a year or two or three is not enough for someone to spend their whole money on you, and you may or may not deliver what they are seeking. But I would hire a personal trainer that is not physically fit, but I have 15, 10 years experience. I'll go with him or her. Because with that knowledge, I can build myself to the next level. I can build myself to the next level with that knowledge. Okay? Because that personal trainer is not going to be with me for the rest of my life. So therefore, the knowledge that they know is what I will be going after and doing the work that they're showing me in the meantime. But how much do they know? I cannot pay them for their expert, for their knowledge. Even though I'm paying them for their time, but sometimes the fact that they are super, they are too knowledgeable, that money is cannot even compete with it. Go ahead and spend your money on them. But if the personal trainer is not fit and lack the expertise, don't spend your money on him or her. You will be wasting your money. All right.